Hey everyone, welcome to Astro Scoop. This is Jeff, the astrology coaching channel that does a deep dive into the planets and signs of the zodiac. If this is your first time here, thank you so much for stopping by. Please consider subscribe. If you're coming back, thank you once again. Today's video in light of the recent new moon at the beginning of August 2024, here are my top five celebrities that were born with the sun and moon conjoined in Leo. Born August 3rd, 1940 is Martin Sheen. Martin is the father of Charlie Sheen, Emilio Estevez, and Martin is a strong character actor that's been involved in many shows, theater, TV and of course movies and in his movies he has shown a sort of commanding but sunny presence in most of his roles with the Sun and Moon and Leo. Born July 29th 1973 is an actor named Stephen Dorff. He's a very hard-working character actor who also has the Sun and Moon, New Moon conjunct in Leo. He looks very Leonine to me, as well as his movements as an actor in his roles. He was in the action movie Blade, where I think he showed very strong Sun, Moon, Leo characteristics. And the Sun and Moon in Leo is dramatic, but it can also be very regal, commanding, and somewhat aloof as well. The oldest person on this list born August 8th, 1926, is an actor named Richard Anderson, who played Oscar Goldman, who was the fictional boss of The Six Million Dollar Man and The Bionic Woman. He had a wonderful voice, a very nice commanding way of playing Mr. Goldman. His fixity, but also his warmth towards the auxiliary characters was very evident, and you could definitely see his Leo. Very, very good show. Born July 31st, 1962, is an actor named Al Sapienza, another hardworking character, mainly TV actor, that has been in multiple roles, multiple movies, and many different TV series. He also looks very leonine to me and shows that in his TV roles. Another actor born on July 31st, 1962, the same as Al, is Wesley Snipes. He's number five on this list. Wesley was also in Blade with Stephen Dorff. Wesley has had a lot of problems in his personal life, but he has also shown the Leo resilience and the ability to bounce back from disappointment and show that son in his roles. Wesley is a very effective actor in expressing his Leonine qualities, especially in Blade, but also in comedies like White Man Can't Jump and he was also very active in the 2000s, 2010s, and most recently in The Expendables with Stallone. So these actors showcase the sun and moon in Leo at birth, which is the new moon. So new moons stand for birth, clarity, and beginnings or fresh starts. So anyone born with the sun and moon in a new moon Leo is going to absolutely express these through the arts or entertainment in some fashion. But you have to look to the houses where the sun and moon are placed to see how that person uses their Leo energy in the natal horoscope. So this video for the week of August 12th, 2024 is the last full week of Leo. Happy birthdays to all Leos. Soon we'll have the Leo Virgo cusp, which will have qualities from both signs. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. I truly appreciate every view. Let's grow this channel. Until the next one, stay safe and be yourself.